Kate brought special drink by William after kids gone to bed dash they look after each other. Kate Middleton and Prince William have been keeping their schedules extra busy recently, but the Duchess of Cambridge remembers to relax in the evenings. Kate Middleton, 39, is known to be a hands-on parent when it comes to her three children Prince George, 8, Princess Charlotte, 6, and Prince Louis, 3. However, a family friend has revealed the Duchess of Cambridge enjoys some time alone when the children have gone to sleep. A family friend told People, William will bring Kate a gin and tonic. They look after each other, but in different ways. The Cambridge children are known to follow a strict evening routine. When asked about why the three children are rarely spotted at evening engagements, royal expert Duncan Larkham stated the young royals normally follow a bedtime routine. He said, it was on a school night, and they are pretty strict. The children are in a rather strict regime, so that might have been the reason. The couple have a hands-on style, observers note. A source close to the Cambridges told The Sun, because of who they are, William and Kate have had to be highly organized parents. But, as parents, Wills and Kate have developed this brilliant knack of letting as much as they can seem spontaneous, and that's how the children see it. The three children are encouraged to stay creative and Kate is said to encourage the two eldest to write, sketch, photograph, and paint weekly journals. Kate is more and more impressive as time goes on, a source complimented. They continued, she is a focused and professional woman. Though the Cambridges have their own private chef, the children stir up trouble in the kitchen as they prepare meals for the family. Kate revealed in 2018, while making food at St. Luke's Community Center, the children even enjoy making pizza. The Duchess said the young royals like making pizza dough because they can get their hands messy. While Kate's children enjoy cooking the main course, the Duchess has said she enjoys baking, preparing their favorite desserts herself. Flourishing Kate has come into her own ahead of next key royal role. Kate, Duchess of Cambridge, is flourishing into her role as a mother and prominent royal, a source has claimed. Kate is just a few weeks ahead of her 40th birthday. And she is preparing to meet this milestone in the best possible shape, according to a royal source. The insider told People magazine, she has really come into her own. And she appears to be admired for her evolution into her role. Joan Black, who was invited to the Together at Christmas Carol service on December 8 in recognition of her work in support of the elderly during the lockdowns, told the U.S. magazine, what she wrote was beautiful, and to bring everyone together like this is lovely. I felt she was really confident. We are doing well if that's our future queen. Ms. Black referred to a foreword penned by Kate and published in the program of the concert held at Westminster Abbey to thank the unsung heroes of the pandemic. In it, Kate described the heart-wrenching isolation from those we hold most dear. She also said, We have lost loved ones, seen our frontline workers placed under immeasurable pressure, and we have experienced heart-wrenching isolation from those we hold most dear. Alongside this, we have seen how communities have come together to support those most in need. And through our separation from others, we have been reminded just how powerful human connection is to us all just how much we need one another and how loving and feeling a sense of belonging to one another can provide comfort in tough times the importance of simply being together kate joined the royal family in april 2011 upon marrying prince william the pair had met a decade prior at saint andrews university in scotland but only started dating after several months of friendship the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge didn't immediately embrace full-time royal work, with William working first as an RAF search and rescue team member, and then as an air ambulance pilot. However, Kate started picking up patronages in her early years as a royal and set down the foundation for her work. One of the legacy-making projects she has worked on for a decade is focused on early childhood. After years of research, work with patronages, and a successful nationwide poll, the Duchess launched in May the Royal Foundation Center.